God, Shang's Buffet is like the best Chinese food on the whole planet. You are only saying that because you get their chicken tenders and fries. Listen, I get much more than their, ta their, fr the their tendies and their fries. I also get their ketchup. Dude, go to In-N-Out if you want wings and fries so much. What, I, I just, I'm not allowed to get them? Or what's the problem? Roderick! No, you are not. Apologies. Roger, this is such a ripoff. Can, can I at least get a fortune cookie or something? Fortunately, you can. Unfortunately, that was a bad joke. Fortunately, I do not give a damn. You will slap your friend in the face? Your waiter's gonna ask you out on a date? Lucky numbers 8, 34, 19, you five. flip it over. <laughs> You will be given up, let down, deserted. You will cry, be lied to, and hurt by a guy running around. Wait, is it just me, or does that sound an awful lot like Never Gonna Give You Up by Rick Astley? That is such a song of all time. But uh, listen, uh, I'm OK with a waiter asking me out on a date, but can I just not be that waiter? So what does this mean again? Don't, don't tell me you've never heard of Never Gonna Give You Up by Rick Astley. I've heard of Take Me to Your Heart by Rick Astley, if that counts. How? They're, they're literally on the same album. So what? It's a good song. Wait, who got the waiter fortune? Uh, I did. Oh, I wanted him to raise his hand. But guys, it's Take Me to Your Heart. It was a major hit in the UK singles chart. And in Ireland, it reached number five. Charting for five weeks. How and why do you know all of this about Take Me to Your Heart in particular? It missed top 10 by one place in Finland. Plus, in the ocean markets, it barely stole out of the top 40 in Australia and New Zealand. What the hell was that for? You're a fake Rick Astley fan. You're a Rick Astley noob. Roderick, let's roll. We're no strangers to love. I would not get this from any other guy. <laughs> 